welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to show you my 10 zero waste swaps for beginners it very brief and precise and straight to the point so i don't want to prolong this vlog so let's start first swaps that uh i use actually i've been using this was to swap bottled water for this stainless steel bottled water or this plastic bottled water i know all household they have this one so please stop buying bottled waters those small bottled bottle water outside and switch to this one it will save you lots of money as well this one is from clean canteen made out of stainless steel but if you have to dip the plastic one make sure it's bpa free and please continue to use it as long as it serves the purpose that you're not buying bottled water outside Please continue to use it until it's worn out and broken and then you can switch to this one afterwards. Another item for the zero waste swap was to switch to this one. Ta -da! This are bamboo bristle toothbrush and it's made out of bamboo of course. Ergonomical and it's biodegradable so did you know that every minute there's thousands of toothbrush that goes on to our landfill and it takes few years no it takes 1000 years to decompose one plastic imagine 1000 years so please i encourage everyone to switch on to this one the next zero waste item was to use this one this are bamboo stick cotton buds so if you are using cotton buds Please make sure you use the bamboo one, not the plastic ones, because these are biodegradable. Also, if you want to use cotton rounds, please try to switch onto this. These are reusable cotton rounds, wherein you can just place in the washing machine after using, and voila, it's clean and ready to use again. Save a lot of money and you save the earth. So, this too, please. Another zero waste item for beginners are these mesh bags. These are very good for produce bags. You can also use it when you're doing your grocery. So if you can refuse plastic and reuse this kind of uh, bags, please do so. Also, if you go to groceries, I know it's one of my problems here in the UAE. They use all the plastics in the world so every time you buy vegetables or fruits they have to put it in plastic before they put the sticker so what I usually do is like this so if you can avoid and use this kind of mesh bags for your produce or for your veggies please do so other than that just refuse the plastic and use this as a shopping bag a nice burrito bag this is from sip still straw uh, it comes with the uh, stainless steel straw and cutleries. These are all reusable, easy to clean. For the straws, you have this bristle, th this brush. So, very easy to clean and you clean it with soap and water. That's it. Every time you go out, just bring it with you so you don't have to use disposable plastic ones. Remember, refuse is the first rule. If you can refuse, then everything will follow. And uh, yeah, another zero waste swap is to use a bamboo brush. So this one I got it from the Philippines. It's from Hua Hua Mulan. Hua Mulan. So this are wooden brush. Better to use a wooden brush. Why? Because it's biodegradable. And but if you do have the plastic one, please continue to use it. Don't dispose it immediately. You can use it, reuse, abuse until it's broken. I do suggest you do that, but this is just an alternative. If you happen to plan to buy a new brush or comb, please buy the wooden one. It helps the environment. And that's about it. Another zero waste swap that I did recently was to use this one. These are uh, shampoo bars. These are from Giga. It's 100 pesos in the Philippines. So very cheap. 
but I will not recommend this if you have if you are more arte with your hair well as you can see I'm not more arte with my hair and I rarely comb my hair but when I do it's very nice <laughs> anyway this one makes your hair very oily and it doesn't smell good so if you're just staying at home please switch to this one other than that they have uh, other luxury brands like Lush they come up with shampoo and conditioner bar so if you do have the budget please try it let me know how was it haven't tried it it's so expensive it's like a thousand pesos here in the UAE if you convert it so I'm just trying to trying on this one so far I'm okay with it because I switch it with my other shampoo until I finish all of my shampoos and my conditioner then I will venture and try shampoo bars on different brands and then I will let you know how was it the last major swap that I did was to switch my sanitary pads to this one these are menstrual cup you can buy it in any eco-friendly shops you have locally also they have it in Souk. online stores they have it everywhere so this is a major swap if you're planning to use this one please do your research make sure you invest on a nice menstrual cup I've used it once uh, it is a big change if you want to transition to this one from your regular pads or tampons this in the beginning will be quite awkward for me but they said it's very safe than using um, pads the regular pads so these are the 10 key things that you need if you want to transition into a low waste lifestyle this is very 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 important and if you have this all around with you then you're one step ahead to having this zero waste or low waste lifestyle so hopefully you will support my journey through this less waste lifestyle i would not say it's a zero waste lifestyle because i'm still transitioning as what i've said and i'm still practicing this lifestyle so i would not prob proudly say i'm i'm been there but i'm getting there this products will be available at the zero waste lab that ae so if you want to follow our instagram page please do so we are launching by august so please watch out for it and and that's about it i'll see you again on my next vlog bye